Hi everyone, Craig here, youtube.com slash level epic. This is my Gotham City build. Uh, I'm sure you know where this is already. It's in the Grand Central Station. Uh, but I've been doing some work around here, not necessarily in this building, but on this map. Uh, I spent the last day putting down these signs. So it'll actually tell me which building is in which video. So now I know which building, see there's one down there too. Um, now I know which buildings I've already done videos on, and I've discovered that there's actually quite a few buildings that I didn't do videos on, so let's go check them out. Um, we're just going to do one at a time, I think, it's probably the best. Um, so here it is, gas station. We're going to go down to the gas station. Oh, also, I lost I lost my map and stuff. Um, there's, it's gone. I don't. I must. I think I deleted my inventory by mistake. So, it's gone. But if you're wondering where we are, we're in the south, um, south of that the the Grand Central Station is just in that direction. But yeah, we're we're south uh, on the southern island. And as you can see, a lot of these buildings have already been shown. Gas station and these apartment blocks. But these two buildings over here, uh, I didn't see any videos for these. So we'll. I'll show you these buildings. This is probably one of the very first buildings I actually did. I haven't been inside these uh, in like probably over a year, so I really have no idea what these things look like on the inside. Um, obviously, <laughs> obviously, I had some uh, size restrictions that that needed needed to be met there. Um, so there's the outside. I kind of like this roof, though. Kind of. The little up edge thing. See, this is before stairs actually joined together, so that's why this looks kind of weird. Same with this one too. Is before the corner of stairs actually connect. So looks a little weird, but that's that's cool though. I'm gonna leave it that that way just because it's different. Uh, let's go inside. So this is obviously a wood, some kind of wood wooden house. Uh, let's go into the basement first. Okay, yeah, so it looks okay. Um, I guess I was using wool back then, so this might have been before iron, maybe? But that doesn't sound right, because they have uh, a lantern there, so I, th I, I think that's wrong. I must have just used wool for whatever reason before I started using iron. You got basement windows. You can see outside, there's a fence outside. Alright, let's, let's head upstairs, and there's a little bookcase there. Let's head up to the main floor, I guess it would be called. Oh, there's a cake, cool, fridge. Oh, this is back when, um, is that, yeah. Back when I used to have dispensers as fridges, that, that's interesting. Um, lantern, and again, wool instead of iron, which is kind of weird, because I don't do that anymore. Nothing in the chest. Pressure pad has like a cutting board, I guess, and a stove, sink. And another one with water. I'm get. This was probably before you put water in these things. Maybe I can't remember. Uh, oh yeah, table. Yeah, that's nice. Nice table. Got some pictures up. Let's head up to the top floor. Top floor, I think. Yeah. Nice large pictures on the walls. This is one tiny bedroom. Oh my. Um, and it's got a closet. Wow. I don't even think I usually do closets anymore inside of bedrooms, just because they take up a lot of space. What's in here? Bedroom still kind of tiny though. Oh, and <laughs> this lever turns on a light and opens a door. That's fancy. Okay, that's cool. Uh, and this is, well, I guess a good name for it would be a wash closet because it is so small. What's up? Nothing. Okay. Uh, and so I guess this, this doubles as both a light source and a faucet. That's my guess. I'm not, oh wow, what a wonderful view! <laughs> that um, wow, you you can see the tiny bit of diamond off on that building there, but that is it. Okay, cool. Um, there's one building. Wow, this, it's funny because because of the roof. The top of this roof seems like, or sorry, the top floor seems to be really spacious because of the uh, the brick roof. It has like that extra, extra height that you don't get down here. Like, t again, this is also back when I used to have uh, two block 
stories. Now I usually use three blocks, so this is only two blocks high, right? One, two. And then a roof. Now I, I usually have three high, and then the roof would be on the fourth block. But I also kind of like this window on, like, I, again, you can't really see anything out of this window. Um, I guess you can, I guess you can kind of see the sky a little bit and see into that person's house. I, I do like the window on the uh, on the stair stairwell. That's kind of cool. And there we go. That's that's the view you want. That's that's, uh, that's uh, anyway. This is a, a not exactly an expensive part of town anyway. So uh, oh, and this one over here we haven't seen yet. That looks interesting. Oh yeah, and then the the basement actually had a door outside too. So that's where this goes. And we'll go check out. Um, also notice this has like no sidewalk. But it has a huge window like right here for people to look in. That's kind of creepy. Oh, and I see there's an enchanting table. You walk in. So this is actually the basement. One of the one of the basement doors. I see there's another one over here. And I guess this is supposed to be like a TV. So it's before I did my usual TV design of like uh, wool blocks and um, what do I put underneath of it? Like stoves or something? Furnace. I usually put furnaces underneath and then black wool on top to make it look like a, a TV, but it looks like I went for the, the painting here. Um, I'm guessing that's just like some kind of table. Nothing in the chest. And again, the furnaces. And I can't even open up the fridge door. Okay, yeah. Still, it's not bad. It's not a bad design. It's almost like a, a basement... I would say basement apartment, but there's no bathroom down here, so I can't really... And it's connected to the rest of the house. Is this only... This might only be two stories, is it? Yeah, okay. So it's two stories. So here's the kitchen. That makes sense now. There's the kitchen and the living room and dining area. And then you come up here, and I'm guessing these are... Yeah, much bigger bedrooms. Much better. A little bit of a closet, even. It's not bad. High ceilings. Check this out. You can... I don't know what you'd want to do up here, but... Very high ceilings. To, uh, oh, okay. This is a bathroom. The chest. This is like a, a shower area. And then separate from that would be a toilet, I'm guessing, without any button. I usually put a button. I guess I don't didn't do that back then. Sink. And uh, what's this? Closet? Yeah, this is just like a linen closet or closet for your bath towels or whatever. Not bad. Um, quite... Interesting, actually, I find. This is this is very different than what I'm used to. See, usually when I make videos, it's usually of stuff I've recently made, not stuff from like a year and a half ago that I don't really remember. But that those houses are really interesting. Actually, I think it would be kind of cool to just grab it and put it into maybe a newer section. Maybe change it a bit, give it a larger footprint so there's a little bit more space. But like the rooms, or the buildings themselves, don't look that bad. I want to keep these the way they are, just to remember what you know what Minecraft was like a year, year and a half ago maybe. But uh, I wouldn't mind copying it, putting it over to a newer section of the map, and just changing it a little bit. Maybe changing the materials where this is just kind of all wood. Maybe change the wood a little bit, change the inside, change the windows, you know, um, change that wool out for iron maybe. Just give it a little bit of a, a redo. Make it a little bit better. Change the roof too, since since this stuff doesn't actually connect for some reason. Yeah, it's just kind of funny how things things have changed in the last little bit. All right, guys, well, that's gonna be it for me for this episode. Thanks for watching. Uh, next video. I don't know. I'm I'm kind of doing a um um an adventure map in Gotham City. So. I might show you, like, I haven't really done much of it yet. The only thing I've really done is I've touched up the airport a little bit. Uh, and of, yeah, well, that's, that's really as far as I got so far. I haven't got very far, to be honest. Uh, I've been doing a lot of stuff at work, so I haven't really had a lot of time for Minecraft. But um, hopefully I will have more time, maybe. I, I don't know if I will. No one has said that I will have more time, but uh, actually people have been saying I will have less time. 
but I'll try. I'll try and uh, see how much I can get done. Um, again, there are, there are other buildings that I haven't made videos of that I can go actually go and just record those. Um, so it actually it wouldn't take any time. It'll just take like the 10 minutes of video time rather than the actual building, which usually takes me hours. But uh, yeah, that's going to be for this episode, guys. Thanks for watching, and we will see you again next time.